What's up, YouTube? Wizbang coming at you with another crazy review. Uh, before we get started, I want you to smash that like and subscribe button down below. And another shout out to Billy Goat Bowstrings and Jimski McDougal. Now, before we get started, I was uh, looking for some hunting gear and um, thought, didn't know what to get. Google it, best product available, Hunter's Element. Jumped on. Had a lot of pictures, looked like they knew what they were doing. There we go, done. So let's jump right into it. I've firstly got a hat. Um, it's raw cat orange stag, dissolve, veil, camo. It's like you can barely see my head. Fits comfortable, light, breathes, lovely. Get that in there. All right, have a bit of a look at that. Yeah, bring that in there, good work. Hasn't got orange, so we can't use it in state forests, but I still look the part. Next of all, I got a GPS pouch. Opens with a little string, nice and quiet. Little pocket here, little zip section here. That's actually from a radio, so it just pops in there, lovely. It just sits somewhere on me, don't know. Saw it in a picture, thought it looked cool. Might not even fit, might not even use it. Could be right. All right, what we got next? So you look at the packaging. That's beautiful, isn't it? It's wrapped up. Got a bunch of stuff. Can't remember what I ordered. Look, it just keeps coming, doesn't it? They're all neatly wrapped. We've got little gloves. Let's get into that. Should check they fit, but we've got grip on the inside. Fingerless gloves. Light as. Almost like examination gloves, you know? Get in there. They look beautiful, beautiful, good camo, good feel, durable and light. All right, so let's get started on the smallest item first. I believe that's this T-shirt. This is a T-shirt, dissolved camo, I believe. Seems to work in New Zealand, which is close to Australia. So that should be all right. Let's roll that out. Oh, look at that. Beautiful, beautiful. Get in there, it's probably shit lighting, but you know. So it looks light, breathable, good for summer, or an underlayer. Hunter's element, that's fantastic. Okay, next item. I have the uh, spur trousers. These are the spur trousers. So, oh, look at that, I'm stand up there. So these are also quite thin, look usable, usable. A lot of flexibility in that, a lot, lot of flexibility. Doable around a boot though, so scuff marks in that. Got some pockets, they hold stuff. And a little side pocket, looks like you can give yourself a bit of a reach around. No, you can't, there's a vent there, no reach around, sadly. Nice and light, I don't think I'd wear them in the uh, winter months, but maybe with a bit of uh, leggings or something underneath it. This one here, we've got an extra large, because I'm a bit fat. That's a long sleeve, it's basically a long sleeve t-shirt. So when it's just that little bit cooler, you can throw it on over the top, it's a bit looser. No hood. Got some sleeves, like a long, long sleeve shirt should have. Once again, all matching camo, so you can look the part, or look like the flog. Whatever your take is. This one is what I'm most excited about. It's the, um, what is it here? I'm that excited, I forgot where it was. The Downpool Elite Jacket. Now this is basically a rain jacket that is folded up so well, I can't unfold it. Oh, there it is. Beautiful. Now look at that, look how long that is. That's coming in. Now I'll just hold it up for you to see, front and back, front, back, it's got like a really durable feel on the back there. Now I'll just quickly unzip it and pop it on, then we'll uh, go to a break and um, I'll pop it on for you and you can see what it's like. Oh, that's, I've zipped that the wrong way, shit, I ruined it. Oh, I think I've bloody ruined it. No, I haven't ruined it. I think it zips both ways. Don't know why I do it, but I'm sure it serves a purpose. 
I'm just going to pop this on just to see if I've got the right size. Probably too big. Have to send it back. I'll leave the wrappers on it. All right. So let's pop all this gear on and, and see what it does. So I've gone and ordered the pants a little bit big. Um, oh, there they go. Um, so the size chart is a little bit off, but I'll go through it. Rain jacket, comfortable, two pockets. I found out what that's for. Zip it up so you can widen it a bit, get to your jolly. And we've got pockets here, big pockets, set on the brochure, you can put shells in there. Now I've heard this is made from 29 recycled bottles, so it's good for the environment. Um, it's also got pocket here for goodies, lollies and whatever. Now um, I'll take this off. In the, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. <laughs> Combat ready. The deer will never see it coming. Right, so the oversized shirt, or the top shirt, it's loose on you. It's not so hot. Breeze, comfortable, very silent. Silent, see that? Listen. Nothing, nothing. Um, the hat's comfortable. I forgot I was wearing it. I'll probably wear it out with my friends. Now, I'll take this one off. Slides right off. Beautiful. Oh, the gloves, so grippy. So grippy. It's like Spider Man. I actually haven't been able to get these off yet. I don't even know if I can. I might have to do this another video on how to take gloves off, or at least wash one. Sorry about this. Look, I'm just gonna leave that one. All right, so that's off, and um, oh, oh, there you go, the pants again. Sorry. Got so now the T-shirt, once again, feels like it's the same, similar material as the long sleeve, light, breathable, works well. Now the pants are lighter than I thought. They're almost the same material again. Um, not pockets, not breathing vents. So they're definitely, definitely a summer pant. But to jazz them up, you wear some tights or a leotard or whatever. Um, so yeah, highly approved. Good summer sort of wear, all like spring. But layer up and that's all good. Uh, that's all I've got for you today. So uh, stay safe.